Hello everybody, my name is Markiplier and welcome to Let's Play Degressiophobia. The beginning! This is a very, very, very interesting mod or custom story that I am very eager to try because supposedly, from what I read in the description, that you can play two characters in it. You swap back and forth between characters. Which is like a very, very interesting mechanic that I'm intrigued to see how it's going to work. Also, it's extremely, exceptionally highly rated and a very new release. It's got a 9.9 .9 right now. I mean, that may fall, but for now, that's pretty incredible. So, let's get started. Mark and Simon had known each other since college. Every Friday, they visited each other. Sometimes, the visit lasted the whole weekend. Other times, one of them went home Friday night. It was easy because they lived close to each other. Mark had his own house next to an old library. Next to it was a three-story building. Simon was renting an apartment at the second floor while he was studying. Simon wanted to be a psychologist. He was still a long way from finishing it, but he studied hard to get there. It was Saturday evening, and Mark was visiting Simon. He'd agreed in the staying until Sunday. Simon needed a book for his studies, so the two friends went to the old library even though it was about to close. <laughs> that felt like I was reading a bibliography right there for a second. But I can forgive that. And minor typos. Also, I think that this particular custom story has a lot of custom music, a lot of custom stuff, even though it's not a full conversion mod, but... Oh, hello! Uh, I suppose I'm just walking in the old library. Hello! Librarian, mistress, please. Point me to the psychological books. Oh. Well, this definitely looks like a library. My book is in another section of the library. Maybe you'll find something interesting in here meanwhile. Who said that? Voice in my head? Is that you, Simon? Simon. Oh, that was Simon. Simon said, I, Mark, I'm playing Mark! Yes! Said I should look for something interesting. Find advanced mutation. Find demon summoning and exorcism. Find spirits and their behavior. Why? I thought this was supposed to be for psychology. Oh, hello! Spirits and their behavior. Click, click! Aha! Uh -huh. Hey, look, a chest. Oh, I guess I should go around. Fine. Now, why would I be looking? Hang on, I'm gonna get what's in this chest. Studium! Ah! Ah! Let me get this one first. Uh, it's no big deal, just a library. Someone's just walking up upstairs, obviously. That is definitely custom music, by the way. Advanced mutation. Ta da! Now, why would two psychology students be looking for these? These kids are up to no good, I swear. All right, now I'm curious how we're going to be swapping in between the two characters. I should look for something interesting. Simon is in there. I shouldn't disturb him. Oh, come on. He's my best buddy. Why wouldn't I disturb him? I should stay in this area. Well, screw you. I'm a rebel. I don't do it. Whoa, hello. Say what? I need to know if Simon is safe. I freaking blocked him off. Simon, are you alright? You are right? Yes, but I can't get out. Please look around and see if you can find a way to get me out of here. How about you climb over to books? Oh, maybe you're scared of breaking the library. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. All right. Mm, Simon, we need to get out of here together and alive. The bookshelves are blocking and Simon can't get out. Maybe there's another way around. Ah, ah, I care so much. He's, he, we're in a bromance together. Uh oh. Closet. Broom. Haunted broom. Bah, okay. Flip. Flip it down. Flip. How about... No. Yeah, here. Um... Well, let's see. Ooh. Ah! <gasps> Ooh! 
am Simon now. Ha <laughs> ha! Cool, cool. Kind of just a teleport mechanic, but you know. Okay, why was Simon in here all by his lonesome? Hmm, private study. Interesting. Oh, this is so cool. <laughs> Seems like Simon's a little bit, a little bit quicker, eh? What's that? Ah, good. I was thirsty. Uh huh. No. Fifth of August, eighteen thirty-five. Today, Justine invited me to the library. She seemed happy and excited. Ah. I was just as happy. I'm glad she wants to see me again. We haven't done anything for months. Even though we aren't officially together, uh -huh. I feel that there is something between us. No, you're wrong. Anyway, she showed me my room where I am right now. It's dark outside, even though it's summer. I can't wait to see what tomorrow will bring. I should get some sleep. Adam. Yeah. What the? Sixth Whoa, hello. August, 1835. <laughs> oh, okay. Today, Justine came into my room quite early. Oh, yeah. <laughs> she says she wants me to come further into the library. <laughs> she seems kind of excited about something she wants to show me. <laughs> I wonder what it is. I didn't even know the library was that big. Is that a euphemism? She told me to dress up. <laughs> then she pulled a lever next to the bed. Oh, it sounded like something moved at the entrance of the library. Oh, some mood, all right. When I finished my diary, we are heading further into the library, she said. I can't wait. We'll stop writing in your diary. She's like throwing you all the signals. G go move on, buddy. Golly. This guy doesn't know what's up. <laughs> I swear, those of those were all euphemisms. Could have all been misconstrued. You see here. Oh, is this another book? Ooh, I can go back to Mark. The good one. Okay, I didn't realize if this was actually in a previous time era zone. It's locked. <gasps> this is open. Well, I mean, this library doesn't seem very big. I don't know how how long this custom story is. It did say it's only the beginning. Oh, excuse me. Okay. Oh, what was it? Oh! Alright. Nothing. Sorry, curator of the library. Wait, curators take care of. No, I'm wrong. I don't know. I don't see anything. What was that? A book! Fine there? No? Okay, alright, I guess there's nothing in here. Come on! Ooh, hello! Bloop. Bloop, bloop. Well, I guess there's nothing here. I'll go back to the good friend. I think tinderbox count is shared. Get out of the way, chair. Get out of the way, broom. Oh, really? Really, broom? You're not gonna keep me trapped in here. Alright, so. It's stuck in this position. So. Was there nothing that I could do? I'm getting out of here. Screw you, Simon. Eh, fine, I'll save you. Hmm. Beware standing in darkness. Blah, 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 blah. I've played Amnesia before, Mr. Game. Alright, I guess there's nothing for me. Wait, did I check that top drawer? I may not have. Wait. There's a top drawer that seemed to be not quite. Yep, okay, never mind. Whoa. It's a cool concept, I will admit. Hmm. I don't even have a lantern. Okay, there's gotta be something in, let's see, rare books. Ergo, there must be some book that's, you know, kind of rare. Oh, oh, no. Never mind. Mm. Mm. Oh, 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 yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, knew it. Oh, get, oh, so strong. Haboosh! Yeah. That. Screw you in your library. As if I need you. Ooh, hello. It's the other door. More books. Something tells me I'm not done here. Ah, oh, come on. Screw you in your face. Are there any special pulley books, maybe? 
Maybe there's a bully book? Come on, don't do that to me. Don't do that to me. There's something over here. Uh uh, doesn't look like it. Nope. Uh uh, uh, this is all a lie. It's all a lie. Let me go back to Mark. Anyway, he was the better of the two, so maybe there was something on his end that I was supposed to do because I was supposed to protect Simon. As I recall. So. I am Mark. I am alive again. Need a final lantern before one can be turned on. I ain't that. Ain't that it's a pretty picture. Hmm. Hmm. Really nothing in here? Nothing at all? No secret button, maybe? No secret secret, maybe? Alright then. Oh, what's that? Hang on, there's a box behind there. Wait, wait. Huh? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Why is there a box back there? Why is there stuff back there? Hang on. Hi! Hi, let me... I, I see them! I see them! I want... I see them. I wonder if I'm gonna find you. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. Is that just like a red herring? Probably a red herring. Or not! Yeah. Was that a... Didn't I get books? I thought I found books. Blast! BLAST AND DAMNATION! So what is making me not done? Why am I not done? Hey, Mr. Man. I feel like there's something about those stuff back there. I mean, I can see it. Why else would they put it there? BLAST IT ALL! Cannot believe I'm getting stuck. Already. Yeah. Uh. Back to Simon. Uh. You know, for all of my pomp and grandeur, I do occasionally make mistakes. Huh? No. Is it? No. And here? No. Oh. I turn there? Huh? Oh, yeah. Oh, come on! I want Justine to show me a good time in the library, if you know what I mean. <laughs> Why are there rooms in the library anyway? I don't even know. Something tells me I'm not done here yet. Something tells me you need to shut up, Simon! God, Simon, you're such a douche. Oh, I'm so mad. I'm just throwing chairs. Alright, oh, I'm pretty sure I've explored everything there is to explore over here. And I don't think that there's anything else over there. Ergo, the game's over, and we're gonna go home. And thank you all for stopping by. All right, bye. Let me go back to Mark one more time before I give up. This is a very oddly placed thingamajigger. No! Mark a jigger! I've just been watching Futurama, so don't judge me. Yeah. 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 Come on! Okay. Is there something up that maybe I have not seen? No? Oh, what's that? I'm a douche? Oh. Okay. Unless there was like a door or something over there. I don't think that's actually anything. Oh, my hand does not change at all. Ah! Balls! Balls! Balls, yeah. Bookshelves are blocking, blah, blah, blah. We need to get out of here, blah, blah, blah. Maybe there's another way around, blah, blah, blah. Well, that sucks. But I have been stuck on pretty much the first level of every single game I've ever played, so I'm all out of time. Thank you so much for watching. Check the annotation for other Let's Plays that I've done. And as always, I will see you...
in the next video. Bye-bye!